my name is Victor Odigoma here. In our class today, we are going to be looking at what problem leading to uh, linear inequality. We have done a lot of classes already, and um, we are in the summarizing uh, summary part of uh, our discussion on linear inequality. So, what we are going to be looking at this time around is what problems leading to linear inequality. So, you realize that um, if we have a problem like this that says a rectangle is x cm long and 15 cm wide, the perimeter is greater than 90 cm. Okay, what is the least possible value of the length? What is the least possible value of the length? So, one, we quickly say solution. We put up a, a rectangle. Okay. So this rectangle is XCM long. XCM long and 15 cm wide 15 cm wide that's the width okay and this is the length and then you know by properties of rectangle that this side as well will also be x cm and then this side will also be 15 cm that's by the two sides are equal okay now they told us that the perimeter is greater than 90 cm that's to say um you know that perimeter is distance around an object distance around an object so if we want to measure the perimeter of this that means we are adding the length okay so i can say perimeter p let's say p is equals to of course you have this okay x plus x in cm plus 15 plus 15 okay this will give us 2x in cm and here 30 in cm okay and then there's something they told us again they said that this perimeter is greater than 90 cm okay that is to say, by implication, this value will be put, will be placed, replaced this p. Okay, so I'm going to have 2x plus 30 greater than 90. Okay, then I will solve for x. So here, I'm going to have 2x is greater than 90 minus 30. I'm sure you're following what I'm doing here. And then this will be 2x is greater than 60. Now, if I divide both sides by, if I divide both sides by, excuse me. So I have 2x, 2x is greater than 60. So if I divide both sides by 2, I'm going to have 2x over 2 greater than 60 over 2. So you have x is greater than 30. Okay. Let me attach the unit of measurement centimeter there. Okay. X is greater than 30 cm. And what they asked us is what is the least possible value of the length? So if the length is greater than 30, you know that x will lie either 31, 32, 33. All these are the possible values of x because it's greater than 30. It's not right. Okay. So by implication, it can be 31 cm, 32 cm, 33 cm. Now, among this range, what is the least possible value? 
So the list is 31 p.m. Okay. So I'm sure that this is how this question can be represented and this is how it can be simplified to answer the question that was asked here what is the least possible value of the length okay so this 31 cm is the least possible value of the length quickly i'm going to do another example in line with this word problem all you need to do is to check the next video i'm going to do and if you have not subscribed to the channel you try to subscribe to the channel and um okay like the video and share it to your friends okay thank you very much for being there